America's sweetheart faced with the ultimate betrayal. To my husband, there's no surprise that my work got better when I met you because I never knew what it felt like for someone to have my back. He set her up for humiliation and he did it at the time of her greatest professional accomplishment. My whole life was working, but I didn't have a home. He allowed her to adore him publicly and he was cheating at the time of the Oscars. It's amazing to me how we can take away people's happiness by telling them that this is the box that you have to stay yeah. in. To everyone who was mean to me, I'm still holding a grudge. I'm always saying I'll never be a father and how much I hate kids. I don't want to screw anybody else up. I don't want her to do that anymore. And I don't know who you think he is or who the world thinks he is. It's humiliating and it's embarrassing. Kids run to George, he runs in the other direction. Very Have you been difficult, in serious Dave. relationships? I, that's all I've had, Dave, is I'm very serious about my relationship. Have you gotten close to marrying any one of these guys? No. <laughs> Even the words, will you marry me? Yeah. And then I just broke out in the cold sweat. I see women who look at George and they just fall apart. And I'm like, what's happened to her? I'm like, oh, that's right. It's George. You said you never want to get married again. No, I, I won't marry again. I don't want to screw anybody else up. I don't want to do that. How does he protect her? Not once asking me to be anything other than what I am. You were like 41, mm -hmm. 42, mm -hmm. 43. Did you think to yourself, you know what? Maybe not. I did think maybe not. Yeah. And then the most destructive storm in U.S. history. Katrina happened in New Orleans and just something told me that my child was there. And the winner is Sandra Bullock on the blind side. To my husband, there's no surprise that my work got better when I met you because I never knew what it felt like for someone to have my back. It's a cheating scandal that has rocked Hollywood. Blindsided by an affair? Is it true you cheated on Sandra? He allowed her to adore him publicly, and he was cheating at the time of the Oscars. He set her up for humiliation, and he did it at the time of her greatest professional accomplishment. But then I looked at him and I just said, oh, there you are. It's like, it's like he'd always been there. We basically are like brothers and sisters at this point. I've known George for half my life, so I've known who th him through several stages of manhood. And I don't know who you think he is or who the world thinks he is, but I know him as so loyal and dedicated to his friends, family, takes care of everybody. not like any other kid. He chooses who he migrates to. He's a really good judge of character. When he wants to have man time, he knows who he wants to have it with. He wanted to have man time, you know, with George. I thought you couldn't have it all. I thought if you had a successful career that you weren't really gonna be able to have one great love in your life. And then Amal walked in. wake up and you're panicked all day long <laughs> you go you, you you know you're walking up the hallways and two o'clock in the morning like oh, I'm just gonna check in on them you worry about you know you hope they're uh, they're compassionate and they have empathy but for the most part I'm just excited to see the kind of people they're gonna be I've been given a great gift I, mean, I was literally wasting time every day until they showed up and now I know exactly what my life is about because of them me telling my story. Let people know that there are hundreds of thousands of children that are ready to be your child. You, you're a forever parent the minute you accept the love of that child. <laughs>
you need a friend in this business. Like if you, if you can sort of, if you can ha take the ride together and support each other, it's a, it's a nice thing. Feel such pressure to excel and be successful, and I think what we're excelling in or what we deem as successful is just completely off the tracks. I feel like I got lucky in life. That I can't believe how lucky I am that I have my wife and these two beautiful kids. And I, I can't imagine that changing for anything. Being a mom, I finally realized this is my purpose.